wow and honestly it's not even that i struggle with it it's that i don't like being bitter there's so much to be bitter about wobin look wobin's saying that uh he's having a hard time with the news digesting news and making him bitter making him angry depressing you now uh, of course right the news is not good right now we're going through unprecedented times there's genocide being committed there's wars being waged there's fascism being rolled out in the western world right there's a lot of bad things happening but there's also a lot of amazing things happening right there's a lot of amazing things happening there's decentralization taking place right now up the yin yang the veil has been lifted on zionism the the uh unipolar world is splitting up into a multipolar world where the u.s dollar will not dominate the world right where where countries and peoples can do trade outside of the u.s dollar outside of something that controls them right countries are breaking away from the stranglehold that imperialism has had on them right there are amazing things happening there are amazing things happening but that doesn't mean we're not about we're not going through some seriously hard times and we are people are questioning the 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 experts in the western world that have been pushing just poison into our lives into society for decades now people are going wait a second if these people were lying about this what else were they lying at so people are doing a lot of research and finding out truth finding out what's what what has possibly occurred in history that they were lied about right so take a look at the news right now i mean best way you can really get an idea of what's taking place take a look at the news right now right and the amount of corporate propaganda bs that has been pushed on society that has been lies right that people have believed that that was the truth right like for example reading new york times the record history record record of history some crap like this they sell themselves at right how many articles have you come across in new york times have been totally debunked and it's just pure bullshit right take a look at that that information at the present and realize that that's exactly what our history is like so what they have lied in real time to us right now that we know about realize that a lot of that they did in the past and people think that's history now when you look back at that you go wait a second that's probably not how it unfolded so if you're really interested you should look into that period and find articles books that were written at that time by people who were questioning the narrative that the corporate propagandists the centralized state was pushing right amazing times 